Alright guys, here we are back on NR 2003 and we've got a special race today here at the Coca-Cola Super Speedway. Um, if you're not familiar with the Coca-Cola Super Speedway, it's not really used for racing as much as it is used for something else. Of the settings we're going to run with today in this race 17 laps, 90 difficulty, 42 opponents. We're going to run the 2004 roster. Did a 2003 Cup Series season, so maybe 2004 is on the horizon. We'll have to wait and see, but well, let's go ahead and get out to the track. No qualifying, we're starting from the back. And uh, yeah, this place doesn't have restrictor plates, so we're going to see speeds of 240 plus miles an hour. Drivers, start your engines. All right, so it is time for the race here at Coca-Cola Spooper Speedway, Spooper Speedway, and we're back in the Enchilada Alley car. It's been a long time, but it feels good to be back where it all started, and uh, something just feels right about driving this old thing. <laughs> so yeah, in terms of setup, I would say that we have good straight line speed. Our turning leaves a little bit to be desired. Uh, Believe it or not, it's kind of hard to set up a stock car to turn at 240 miles an hour, so we shall see how we do, but I think our uh, drafting and our suck ability is fantastic, so hopefully we can utilize that. If you guys are new, go ahead and subscribe to the channel for me. I really appreciate you watching. Let's get this thing underway. The green flag at Coca-Cola Super Speedway. We come under the flag here. Whoa, Terry Labonte dives to the inside. We're gonna take him on the bottom. We go three wide to T1 here. Over 200 miles an hour. Three wide multiple times on lap one. High racers hate him, but why not? Gonna send one up his inside here. Take advantage of the momentum we have as we trickle towards 230. Have to lift out a little bit to get it to stick at the bottom. So we lose a bit of momentum, but hopefully we're able to keep up. You see we got the big suck here. We're flying 241, 2. Almost three. Where to go though, we have to back out. See this track is so wide, it just invites three wide, four wide racing. AI is definitely uh, well suited to take advantage. They make moves all over the track. Take it three wide, possibly four. Really want to get clear here. At least so we have a little bit of angle to turn into. So I really had to lift to keep it on the bottom. Lost a lot of momentum, lost a couple spots out of it, but we're all clear. It's a game of momentum. It's a lot like a Indy 500 racing. Gotta time your moves well. The slipstream is massive. So you see, we carry good momentum that time. We're going to get multiple spots on this straight. So take it three wide. Do we send one up his inside? Let's say no. Right, so we're into the top 30. Definitely not stressful. Smooth, no problems. I'm not gripping the wheel as tightly as I can or anything. Got a 
to make sure we keep up with this pack here. We got Vickers pushing. I know we have good top end speed. Come on, baby. Kind of making the middle groove work a little bit. We do get a good run here. Back to Brendan gone. Right, five laps in. Making solid progress. Starting to string out a bit in front, and uh, they could break away if they do that. Johnny Sauter is going to move to the inside. We're going to force our way up his inside. Bring Casey here along with us there. When we're clear, we can be fast in the turns, but we have to use the whole track just about. Dale Jarrett's miles high up there. Gone defends to the inside. We're going to look to his inside. Straights are just too long and we had too much speed. Oh, we're going to get Jarrett as well. Our old rival. We're still picking them off, one by one here. Now this is going to get awkward. Don't think I can get to the inside. Clear uh, Skinner there. Near the top 25 at this point. Things are starting to uh, go a bit more single file at this point. See there's a bit of a gap to the pack ahead, so just hope we can hang with these guys and that it'll all come back together. We got 10 laps left in this race, lots of times for things to happen. Takes us a little checking up from the pack ahead. As you see, we have good speed. To the inside here. Andretti. And Nadu. Two one cars. Has the one and the O one in the number one O one. Bobby's gonna give us that good suck. Just a little breath of the throttle on the entry is letting that nose turn in. That's really what it takes at this point. Tires starting to uh go away just a tiny bit as we head near the halfway point. And this is a sweaty race. So you gotta really be up on the wheel. Kind of not getting a good draft here from the car ahead, so we're losing out a little bit. Just have to hope they check up just a tiny bit. Car's not turning like it once was either. It's like if things stay as they are, we might only have a chance at a top 20, but never know. Right back up to these guys now. Bobby's been giving us some good slip streams, so we're gonna stay right behind him. Got a chance to look to his inside. We're gonna dive. Just about make it work there. 
Although he's going to come back hard on the outside. Sterling makes a move to the inside. We're going to go to the extreme inside. Uh-oh. Had to really lift there to keep it pinned to the bottom. Lost out big time. Jarrett's giving me a good push though. Get me back up to speed. Keep my momentum up. It's the lead group. Goes three wide for the lead, but they're off in the distance now. Look at this run. Monstrous overspeed. Look at them come back on the exit of the turn, but hopefully by the end of the spray away, we'll uh, get a little bit more. We're Burton gonna pull down in front of us. Looks like the best we can get is uh, 18th, so we're going to go for 18th. No point holding back here. Ah, came up off the bottom. Bobby Labonte flies by me on the inside. The absolute lad. Come right back at him. Definitely not a dive bomb. It's not going to work. So we need to build that momentum back up. Send it three wide. Why not? Got lucky to survive that, and we're clear. We pass Biffle. Still really want to get to the lead of this group if I can. Get as many spots as possible. Eh, why not? Hold. We somehow do. Bobby loses out on the outside. We're clear. Bobby's got one car width and he's using it all between me and the wall. And we're clear. We're going to pull over. Jared's coming big time on the inside. Although we have the slipstream so we should come back around him and we do. Barton moves to the inside of Mayfield. Two to go now. Follow Ward Burton through on the bottom here. Came up the track just a bit, but we're okay. Looks like Terry Labonte got lapped. Terry Labonte sucks. He better not get involved in this race. For us, at least. Whoa, Jarrett with a nice move there on the inside. One lap to go. Okay, it's checkers or wreckers for 18th place. So we're hopeless on the outside, you have to feel. Just praying we carry a good runoff. We don't really. Pretty much have to clear Numachek, get to the bottom and make a crazy move. Well, 
that's what I did. We're going to come home with a top 20. A 19th in the end. Sterling Marlin is not coming home. <laughs> Let's get the heck out of here indeed. A crazy race. Super fast. Not a lot of room to make wise decisions. I'm pretty happy with that result. So I hope you guys enjoyed that race. Just a little bit of fun here at this crazy super speedway. If you guys could, go and subscribe to the channel, like and comment on this video, and I will see you in the next race. Whoa! <laughs> we got one dead down there. Oh my god! We got big time problems with that motor, buddy. Whoa! Keep it under 65. Keep it under 4,500 in second. Watch that speed now. Keep it on 4,500 in seconds. All right, so we're going to make a pit stop.